Okay, here is my Sephiroth coat. So I'm still kind of working on it, but I just thought I'd give you a look. It's getting close to being finished. And I still have some work to do, but I just thought now that I've got a new iPhone video capability, I can actually show stuff. But as you can see, I'm still kind of hemming this part. You can see all the little uh, um, pins there. And this is my wonderful dress form that I finally got, yay, for free from a friend who was looking to get rid of it since you know, she doesn't sew a lot anymore. And I was happy to take it. It was awesome. Yay. And this thing has been invaluable. So let me turn it around here. One of the most important parts and what made me really want to do a custom coat is here's the money right here. I created a slit in back for my wing, the harness for my wing that um, hopefully I will have very soon. And um, so what we can do here is have the harness go inside here. It'll wrap around my waist and then the wing can stick out from here. And what I intend to do, um, when we get a little more, more done, I'm going to put sew in some hooks and eyes on the sides here so that way I can close the seam all around the, where the wing is. So it would be like if the wing's, you know, right here, I can close it up here and down below here so then it really looks like just the wing is coming out of the thing and the jacket's still kind of close. So, so you can't see the seam as well. Um, one thing I'm kind of a little disappointed with is the collar. It's a little bit more droopy. I should have put some interfacing in it, but I, for some reason I thought the, the stuff would be stiffer. Um, but, you know, it's the way it goes sometimes and I really don't want to undo it because I spent a lot of time getting all these gorgeous seams in here for the collar. I'm actually quite proud of how it came out. I just wish it were a little bit stiffer. But that's okay. I don't want it too stiff, so because that would be bad. Um, one thing here is what's different from my, the one uh, that I bought. I don't know if you can see it here. It's kind of dark, but um, let's see. Yeah. No, I don't think you can quite see it because it's kind of dark, but um, I actually have another seam right here in the middle of the coat. Instead of... I can't touch you. <laughs> Hang on, let me see if I can get it put more into the light here, maybe from a different angle. No, it's still dark. Um, but on this, oh, there we go. Uh -huh, you can see it now. On this side, there's two seams there, an extra kind of section in the coat right under the sleeve. I noticed in um, in the actual Sephiroth picture that that is more accurate. He actually has a separate section with two seams, one on either side, whereas the coat I had before only had one seam where the front and back connected, but now I was able to put in that extra section so to make it a little bit more accurate. And now I'm going to do the next part for the buckles. I'm going to show you right here, over here. Okay, here is how I'm going to make the buckles. Open. So I'm going to take these two things and spray paint. These are actually cabinet handles of all things. I spotted them in the store and they're pretty cheap, just little plastic handles. What I can do is I'm going to put some screws in here and some super glue to put them together. And then I'm going to spray paint them silver and use them as the buckle. They're nice and big, which is good, but not, you know, too crazy big. It was the closest thing I could find to Sephiroth's the square buckles that you see on Sephi's coat, so I think this is going to work quite nicely. But um, we'll see. I haven't tested this yet, so we'll see how it goes. And here, this is a little helmet I found at Value Village. It was originally a little police, a costume police helmet, but it turns out it's going to make be very useful to make perhaps make some armor for Seth's shoulder armor. We'll just have to see how this goes. I haven't tried it yet. Hopefully it'll succeed. But um, that's all for now on the progress of Sephiroth. And I'll get back to you when more things are finished.